What's up, everybody? Um, thought I'd let y'all know there's ways to get out of traffic violations. There's uh, plenty of ways. First way is to not commit the violation, of course. But if you do get pulled over, be nice and um, just you know don't don't try to argue with the officer. The guy's just trying to do his job, just like you are, and um, so just take it as that. Now, most of the time, if you do get a, if you do get pulled over, and you're honest and you're cordial and friendly with him, and not appear to be nervous, most of the time he's not going to write you a ticket. But uh, even if you were if, if you think that you were, you know, riding what you're doing and he's pulling you over for the wrong reason or whatever, just be nice to him. He's just doing his job. He may be a moron, but he's still doing his job. All right. After that, you have options. And, and I wish I knew these options before. And, um, and I guess I did, but I thought, oh, they'll never work. Just pay it. Well, no fight the ticket do not pay the ticket go and get you a court date all right see the judge and I will tell you and I will tell you this from experience that most of the time you will not get a ticket your case will be dismissed and more importantly most importantly is that the traffic violation will not go on your record so fight it, all right. Um, in my case, the officer didn't show up to court, and uh, so automatically it's dismissed. But those other two tickets I've had in the past, one running a red light and which was green when I ran it, I could have fought it. I didn't. I was lazy. I just went ahead and paid it. Later, I paid for it. Um, two was an improper lane change which is another case to where I could have fought that and if I did I would have been way better off you know because more likely I did have evidence that I that I uh, could have won even if the officer did show up and we were trying to talk to a jury you know convince a jury so I could have won that with the evidence that I had and the lack of evidence that he had so there you go fight this stuff you cannot even if you were doing 50 in a 30 fight it you know even though you know you did something stupid fight it anyways um because your driving record is the most important thing we all screw up i don't care how perfect you think you are we all screw up and it's just the times that we get caught screwing up. Some people have gotten lucky. So um, take that advice. This is for everyone, not just new drivers. This is for everybody. So um, take care out there, 73.